while no Nigerian president has been removed by the court, there is a growing feeling, particularly among the opposition, that the tribunal might order a rerun for the presidential election held on February 25, 2023. It's been 193 days after the hotly contested election and 99 days since Bola Tinubu was sworn in as Nigeria's 16th president. However, the race for who will oversee the affairs of Africa's biggest economy rages on. The election, a three-horse race between Atiku Abubakar of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, Peter Obi of the Labour Party, and Bola Tinubu, who was declared the winner by the country's electoral body, was allegedly marred by election violence, malpractice, and result manipulation. What has followed the election is an intense legal battle as Peter Obi and Atiku are seeking court intervention to overturn the election result. While it remains unknown how the judges will rule on the matter, some Nigerians consider a rerun as the most likely outcome. While in the past the court has ordered a rerun after months of legal battles at the state level, no presidential election has been overturned by the court since Nigeria gained independence in 1960. Although it is likely that a rerun declared by the presidential tribunal will be appealed by President Tinubu and APC, the power shift has allowed at the state level, where the third-ranking official in the state to be sworn in as acting governor, is applicable at the federal level, if the Supreme Court affirms tribunal's ruling. Section 146, subsection 2 of the Constitution states, where any vacancy occurs in the circumstances mentioned in subsection 1 of this section, during a period when the office of vice president is also vacant, the president of the Senate shall hold the office of president for a period of not more than three months, during which there shall be an election of a new president who shall hold office for the unexpired term of the last holder of the office. The nullification of the February 2023 presidential election by the Supreme Court implies the removal of both President Bola Tinubu and Vice President Kashim Shetima, as they are considered a joint ticket. And if this happens, Senate President Goswil Akbabio, a member of the ruling party APC, will be sworn in as acting president. A position is expected to hold for not more than 90 days, during which INEC will conduct a fresh presidential election.